go ahead and get started on the different things that I use as far as hair accessories and hair tools that help me to on my healthy hair journey while I'm relaxed okay so the first thing that I use always is um, these uh, little uh, containers and I find these at a beauty supply store or a dollar store and I like these metal ones I really do like those um, and also have this uh, plastic one okay and these are the ones I just put my little concoctions in like this one this is the concoction I was talking about on my last video I have it in here and um, I just spray it on my hair and I love these things okay because uh, you can take um, maybe you maybe you bought a product that has a pump or something and it's not working or whatever it came in just doesn't work for you so what I did one of them uh, this is uh, my Alpha G leave-in um, conditioner and I didn't like the bottle having it always um, having it always uh, uh, lift the lid up and then squirt it in my hand so I just poured it all in here and I can just squirt it on my hair or at least squirt it in my hands and rub it together and put it all on my hair as I desire so these right here so these type of um, tools um, are must-haves for me and I will actually recommend them to you um, of course some of my uh, other pro other items that I have hair tools accessories are combs um, of course I got this shower comb it came in two uh, two pack I use one of my mother uses the other one but I have uh, I got these from Sally's I forgot how much it is I think $2.99 but this is what I comb this is what I use to comb my hair when it's wet and when I'm as a, when I finish washing my hair or something like that this is what I use this type of comb I use a shower comb it doesn't tear your hair or anything like that um, outside of the when my hair is not wet and what, or when I want to comb my hair I don't do much, much manipulation now that I'm stretching I don't do a lot of manipulations usually my styles are low maintenance so I don't have to bother my new growth and my regular hair I don't want to you know in the part, relaxing I don't want to bother it too much but this is the comb I have I got this from a beauty supply or Sally's this is the brush I have um, one of the brushes that I use I also have like a, a boar bristle I'm sorry a, I actually have a small one this is the little baby one um, one side this is soft side and this is a hard side so I also have the little bore small baby bore brush I don't usually do a lot of uh, brushing to my hair though also have one of these brushes okay um, some other items that I have for my hair um, I also have a satin uh, a coarse satin bonnet for my hair and if you don't have one of these go out and invest one you don't have, you don't need to wrap your hair up with every cloth you can find you need a satin some satin a satin pillowcase satin bonnet and this is what I have my little satin bonnet I had it for the longest bought this like a Sally's or some beauty supply I also have a mesh wrap for when I wrap my hair um, I bought this as well satin mesh wrap and you just wrap it around once you wrap your hair around it's, and it snaps in the front okay this is my Remington um, this is my flat iron that I have. I do want to invest in a Chi, but I'll do that later. Um, this is my Remington flat iron, and it is a one inch digital uh, Remington flat iron, and um, it goes up to 430 uh, degrees, and it is tourmaline, titanium, and ceramic all in one, okay? And I got this for Walmart for uh, $38.94, and I just love this thing. It uh, you know keeps the moisture in my hair. My hair is... Uh, shiny and yeah it doesn't damage my hair although I never go up to 430 on it especially with relaxed hair um, yeah but I love this because the Remington is digital I can see I can um, it has automatic shut off I can go up the dial down the dial however I want to do it so I love that this is my blow dryer I'm not going to take it out the box hopefully you can see it it's my blow dryer I have for, I got this from Sally's this is the and I'm not for sure how to pronounce it, Jill Bier de Paris. You know how they have their uh, their own line of products. And so this is what I have is ceramic. And uh, yeah, and it has the little nozzle on it, not the comb on the end. It has the nozzle. And usually when I blow dry my hair, it's just best for me to blow dry it. As I'm blow drying it, I'm brushing it. And I'm brushing it and I'm blow drying it. I put the nozzle on my hair and I'm just brushing it or I'm combing it. Usually I brush it and that just works well for me and it gets my hair a nice uh, straightness where I don't have to, um, you know, do a lot of, put a lot of heat in it, depending on the style I'm looking for. Also, I have this because I do have a blow dryer, um, a hooded blow dryer, golden hot hooded blow dryer that I have, but I'm not going to call that um, here but I do have that that's what I sit under for deep conditionings 
or uh, sets or something like that. That's what I sit on. Also, I love these where you just hook this up to, this is a heating cap. Um, actually, it's a bonnet. And you just hook this up, put this on the end of your blow dryer, and you can um, put this on your head and it'll dry. It blows up. And that way you can move around with it or, you know, you don't have to sit under that big old, um, you know, sit under the dryer all the time. You can just sit under this and it's a dryer. Um, it's just a, it's, I would say it's more of a heating cap. Not a heating cap, because you, you're actually using the blow dryer. It's just uh, going through this, okay? And I love this because, as I said, it's, you know, it's versatile. I can move and still have it on. I can move and still have my hair being drying, uh, drying or um, being deep conditioned. So that's what I like. And let me just show you the picture so you can see what I'm talking about, okay? That's what it looks like. And here's another picture. But that's what it looks like once you put it under the dry once you put it on the nozzle end of the dryer and you can move it's a hose it's um it attaches okay to your handheld dryer and uh yeah so it's hand washable and perfect for travel that way you know you don't have to use the hotel dryers and not knowing what type of dryer there is or anything like that okay so i love that also this is my remington heated clip rollers okay um it sets the curls in five minutes, and this is also using the Thermaline Titanium and Ceramic, okay? And this is also Remington, and I use these rollers. It looks just like that, so I don't have to take it out. Um, yeah, so when I want a quick do, I don't want to curl my each strand or something like that, or I have some curls and they might have fell a little, I just put my little heated roller, I let them sit for a minute, put my little heated rollers in there. Five minutes, five to seven minutes, five to ten minutes, however long I want to leave them in there. Uh, yeah, and then those rollers act uh work really well when my hair is uh you know freshly relaxed and not a lot of products in it and stuff like that okay because you want the curls to hold and not just go limp on you okay okay and this is something that i found i don't know if you guys know about the bump it when you put those little hump you see people with the little humps in their head usually i just do those naturally put a little hump maybe a ponytail or something but i remember i saw the bump it in walmart and it was actually sold out and so the other day i was with my mother in the dollar tree and i came across this and it's and it's called high on hair get that just walked out of the salon look in a few easy steps and it actually looks to me like the bump it and this costs one dollar okay and it comes in three sizes and what you do I'm not sure what type of time I have left but what you do it comes in here and it also comes with a rat tail comb which you gotta love again okay can't have too many rat tail combs and it comes in different sizes of the bump it's okay and um, yeah let me show you the bigger one so you can see. So, the bump it, usually you just put this over right here on your head. And you will pull your hair, maybe put it back here and pull a big a big hunk of your hair over it. And you will have that hump. And no, you people don't see it. Anything like that is fully covered. It looks like you have a regular hump. And I would say this is just like the bump it to me. I didn't get an opportunity to try the bump it uh, because they were sold out when I went to Walmart. But, yeah. It looks like the bump it to me and for a bump it price one dollar okay um my um what do you call this anyway i can't remember oh my hair donut this is my hair donut i love this thing especially during my stretches and when i'm keeping my hair off my shoulder this is what you how you make your ponytails okay and you just put this over your hair and just say for instance I had all my hair up, I'll put this over my hair just like it was a ponytail holder and my hair will be sticking up. And so I would just uh, feather my hair out over this and put a band on it and it looks like, and it's a ponytail, okay? And it gives you that, uh, it gives your ponytail that rise, okay? So I love this thing. I got this from Sally's I, from a, for a long time ago. I don't remember how much it costs, but I love this. If you want your nice ponytails, put them on the side, up, down, back, go to Sally's, get you one of these little hair donuts, okay? things at the beauty supply they're called ear protectors and this costs 99 cents and they're pretty much just two let me take them out right quick because I haven't put heat in my hair so I don't need them right now but there are two ear covers for your hair you know how you're sitting under the dryer and you don't want um, the heat is all on your ear and all that stuff here they got Ain't that something? Somebody's smart. I see. I should have been getting paid for these, okay? Because how many times we been sitting under the dryer and and we put a towel or something, and we could have just thought about making this, went to the invention, 
uh, went, signed it up, got the copyright, all that other stuff, and could have got some money, okay? So somebody did it. And so, yeah, you can't beat that. And it covers your ears so you don't get burnt by the dryer. Love them. Of course, now uh, they've gotten a little more advanced, and they have satin rollers just like this. And um, I got these from Sally's. I'm, I'm sorry, I got these from CVS for probably $11.99 or something like that. And I like them because they're foam, and they fold all over. Uh, yeah, so I like these. Foam rollers, love them. Uh, but as I said, I will be investing in the satin rollers, but I've had these for the longest. And um, I love them because they give you that tight curl, depending on the type of style you're looking for. Sometimes I do like my tight curl because I would like to pin it up, and I want them all to stay a certain way or just let them fall as the time goes, okay? Um, also, I have the little palm rods. I have them on different different sizes, the gray ones, the white ones. I also have some pink ones somewhere. And sometimes, also, I um, used to, I believe I did this with my braid locks more. Um, I might put them also on my uh, braid outs ends to curl my ends. But I also took the sponges off the um, old rollers I used to have. And I used the, um, I don't know, what would be the scale or the... Yeah, the frame, I use these as well, okay? And they also give you a tight curl. So just depending on what look I'm looking for, those are some things I would use. As you guys know, as I said, I'm not doing any curly do's and all of that now until my until November for my uh, 30th birthday is when I'll start back doing more stuff to my hair. But I do I did want to invest in some of these rollers, and these are um, these are the rollers that you can uh, self roll your own self, and they have them all in different sizes. And um, and these came well, actually I don't know if you can see in the back it came with clips and also a rat tail comb and I got these from Target and actually I'm not for sure if you can see it says $9.99 on here but uh, normally these rollers are $14.99 and I was going to I forgot when I got these but I was going to wait to get them later on because they were $15 $14.99 but someone in Target one of the employees put $9.99 on this tag and when I got up to the register it wrote it um, it wrong up as $15.99 and I said no, oh $14.99 I said no it's okay I'll, I'll uh, get them later and the um, guy at the register said well you know since they have this price tag on here we have to honor it so if you want them for $9.99 you can get them so I said sure thank you put them in the black so I got these and so when I begin to start curling and curling my hair and everything uh, later on this year I'll be using these rollers okay so when I do my curly set and so I'm looking forward to that, but uh, yeah, I got these from Target. I also saw them at Walmart for the same price, but it's just good that I actually went to Target that day and I saw $9.99 and, $9 and I got them and I was like, whoa! Uh, and he let me, he honored that request, so I thank the Lord for that mistake some employee did, okay? Right now I'm on a six month uh, stretch. Actually, I'm currently three months post. Actually, today I'm officially three months post, okay? And this new growth is, uh, yeah, it's attacking, okay? Um, but so when I, uh, and I'm also, I'm on a, in my stretch, I'm also keeping my hair off my shoulder. I had something, um, a function, a gathering that I went to and I had my hair and uh, I put them some braids and just did a little braid out because I wanted something different for the function, okay? But, um, I, and today is also wash day for me, so I'm getting ready to wash this hair and put it right on back up. I'm normally wearing buns, something like that to keep it off my shoulder. So hopefully that was just a little insight into the things that I use. And um, I'm getting ready to wash this hair, and I hope you guys are having a good day. And I'll talk with you soon. Any questions, comments, just let me know. All right, talk with you soon. Bye-bye.